guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Terry and I like to buy stuff and you found Terry Buy Stuff. Hey, if you're new here, hit that subscribe button below, ring the bell. That way you'll be notified of more shopping fun that happens here on this channel. So today I bring you a new shoe product. Have you heard of Kizix? Because once you click one ad, they will be all over in your Facebook, your Instagram, your YouTube, they'll be everywhere. So I actually broke down and, and bought a pair. Look at these, these are the Echo Madrid. So I did take this one out and try it on just to make sure it fits. But this is a really nice presentation. Kind of see here. It comes straight to your mail, just like this. And this should be, yep, this says the Madrid Black Black. It says new look, great shoes. And that's really nice. Also, if these weren't to work out, look at this, easy. Just close the box, stick it back in, ship it, and you're off and running. So I think that's really cool. So let's move this over to the side. Oh, this is pretty cool. Okay, so right here it says, step right in, step straight down, and pop into your Kizix. Literally, these are hands-free shoes. I know it's really hard, they're so black. Here's why I bought black. I have a convention coming up that I'm gonna have to work. These shoes are going to take a flight to Washington, D.C., and they are going to help me work a convention floor. That is my hope. Now, when you look at laces, of course I could tie them underneath so we didn't see the bows, but look at these. They're made of fully recyclable material and it has a spring right here. So when you step into it, it just pops back up. So I should be able to just put my foot in and not worry about crushing the heel. I mean, this thing's pretty solid right there. Oh, there it is. There's that spring action. The insole is curved, so it's supposed to be pretty comfortable and an all day wear. They have this new technology that they put into this shoe specifically. So it's like a hands-free shoe. Now, when I think of hands-free shoes, you know who I think of? Um, I really didn't buy these because they were hands-free. I thought I bought them because they sounded really comfortable and they sounded easy to use. But the more I think about it, how about people aging in place, people with Parkinson's? This should be so easy to just like pop in and, and go and literally not have to fight, bend over, tie your shoe. You know, they're just put them on and go. So I'm looking up the core features of the Kizik. Like I said, patented hands-free labs shoe entry technology. This has breathable, removable, and washable contoured insoles. It's an ultra cushy rabbit foam outsole. So you can literally, it says stand on it all day. And when I push on this, man, this does feel like there's gonna be a lot of cushion and support for me in there. So that, that was another reason why I was interested in this shoe particular, because it seemed like it had some support from just reading the reviews online. Uh, adjustable lacing, and then this is available in sizes 4.5 to 15 and EE widths. So there is, even in the regular size, supposed to be a lot of room in the toe box. So if you're kind of, you know, shoving your foot in there, sometimes when I buy tennis shoes, um, I have bought shoes before that have like, you know, sewing here and it rubs my little toe and then it hurts and then I don't wear the shoes. This is a nice, clean toe. The fabric is very clean. This is almost like a little suede. And this, of course, breathable mesh. So this is why I picked this shoe that I hope is going to be great for me on a convention floor because by the time I put my pants on, these laces should be hidden by where the pants will hit and then it just kind of looks like a black shoe. Is it the prettiest shoe? No, but is it hideous? No, <laughs> but you know what? You hit an age in life where it almost becomes like, I don't care what they look like. Just let them be comfortable. Please let them be comfortable. <laughs> so I did get this in a half size up of my regular size 
just because I knew I would be wearing socks in them. I wanted a little extra room. I did try one of them on already. I haven't tried both on and it felt really good. So I'm really interested in how these are going to hold up all day running through an airport convention floor. I am going to put these Kizik's to the test. But I think first, before we take them all the way to Washington DC here from Vegas, right? I'm going to try them on just so you can see. And I, I found some uh, white socks of mine because I want you to see exactly where they're hitting on the ankle. So let's try these on and take a look and just kind of you know, go walk around the backyard for a minute, see how they feel, see how they, they look on the foot. I mean, overall, I think these are going to be a great breathable shoe, and I'm super excited about all the technology that's packed into this shoe. So let's do a quick slip in. Look, no hands. You see my white socks. I wanted you to see the socks. Oh my gosh. So that was really easy. Oh, wow. That one, I didn't even have to fidget. It looks hideous with these white socks, but I wanted you to kind of see where they hit. They feel pretty good. Nice and a lot of support down there. Okay guys, I think they feel really good and I'm ready to pack my suitcase and take these things on my work trip to Washington DC and let's really put Kizix to the test. So guys, it's day one in DC for me and I'm over on National Harbor. Uh, you can see way back there in the back, there's the Ferris wheel. I'm here for a work conference. So I wore the Kizik's all through McCarran Airport. I had to connect in Dallas and then I had to fly into DC. And I gotta tell you, I think they're pretty comfortable. I'm gonna break down some of the things that I, I'm finding I don't like about them in some close-ups, but my feet don't hurt. I feel refreshed. I mean, I don't feel like I'm pain from wearing new shoes. And we're just going to keep walking on through DC and see what kind of fun we can have in my Kizix while I'm at my conference. So I've been walking around the outlet mall in the Kizik's. I found, uh, what is this place? It's Tanger. The Tanger Club. And I've just been kind of walking through these Kizik's. I've got a bunch of shopping bags and I thought I'd give you a little close up in the wild, right? Kizik's in the wild. I'm trying to make this video light enough that you can see it. Look at that. They're holding up pretty well. There's a good shot of them. So overall, doing pretty good. Had a fun day out here shopping and um, I'm up over 6,000 steps in these things on my Fitbit. So we're definitely putting the Kizix to the test. So guys, the Kizix are so versatile. So I'm getting ready to go out. Um, I'm trying to like film into a mirror here, but get ready to go out to a dinner and I want you to see. I paired the Kizix with some jeans. And just like, you know, nice dress coat, work top. Of course, we have to wear a mask in this hotel, so I'm showing you the complete look. But again, 
Oh, dang. Comfort. Yes. I'm loving these kids. All right. Let's go hit the street. I gotta sh shut my, my lights off. Oh, here's my room. <laughs> this is where they put me up in DC. It's nice. Very pretty. And uh, now, off and running. And watch this. Watch. Literally, you're out. You're in. Step out. Watch. Foot's out. In. So easy. Love them. Okay, guys, here we are. Day two of the conference. I have paired today the Kizix with just a nice black suit from Eloquy. It's a nice fitted suit with this flowy top. Got to wear a mask. Got my, got my conference badge. And look, they, I mean, honestly, it's okay. It looks a little, you know, industrial boring. Let me see if I can ooh, ooh, go back in my bathroom here. Um, but honestly, I think it works. I think it works and I think it's going to be so comfortable. So that's half the battle. So guys, what you saw there was my trip to Washington, D.C. It was really like my big coming out into the world. Um, I've done some other work trips, but that was the big one. And the one where we had to dress professional at times. We had to dress more like uniform at times. There was a lot of walking. Uh, you basically had to walk to everything, not only the conference, but walk to meals, which was great. That area of National Harbor and the Gaylord Resort, it was epic. So I did wind up bringing dress boots to wear um, and then the Kizzix, and that was it. So I had two options, dress boots, Kizzix. So right away, I had really only wore these locally here. Um, I had worn them to Lake Las Vegas, kind of walk around there and go to a meal, but I put them on, ran to the airport and didn't even think twice. And you know, normally I, I'm one of those people that my feet will swell in long flights and the flight to uh, DC is a little longer. So I did have compression socks on, but what worried me right away into the flight where I got concerned is look at all this is molded, okay? So however much this is gonna give, that's all you get. It's not like you can untie your shoe and give yourself extra room because it's all meshed in there together. They started to get tight on the flight and I was really getting worried. I was like, oh my God, this is the only pair of shoes I have besides boots with a smaller heel. I could be in trouble. But honestly, we got through the flight. I had the compression socks on and as soon as I started moving around, everything was fine. So I will admit, if you are somebody that has a lot of weight in here, or you get fluid buildup, these might not be the shoes for you. Um, just because, I mean, you can, you can, you get a lot of give though, if you really undo the, the laces. And that's what I had to do. I redid the laces and made them more looser, but I wore them throughout the entire conference. So I wore them with a suit. I wore them with casual wear. And guess what? I pulled it off because one night I went out to dinner and I wore the dress boots and my feet were dying by the time I got back. And I was like, oh no, I'm not gonna be able to wear the boots the next night because our feet's just not used to being normal feet right after we've been working from home in kind of this pandemic time that we're in. So we got through that that little, little you know, questionable spot and then now we're here. I literally walked 7,000 to 16,000 steps a day there, all in the Kizzix. I ditched the boots. I wore the Kizzix the whole time. And every time you put your 
foot into it. Like you want to think you're going to, it's like psychologically, you think you have to bend over and you don't. I mean, that spring, that spring here, that's the spring that's in the shoe here. It just lets you put your foot in and you're, you're done. It's hands-free shoes. People were giving me crap, you know, cause I was like, oh, I'm wearing hands-free shoes. You know, it's like the new technology. And it was so funny cause one of the girl's shoes came untied and I was like, Hmm, wouldn't have had that had you had some hands-free shoes. <laughs> she had to bend over and kind of come in and out of her shoe. So overall, they are hands-free. They, they're definitely getting the Terry Buy stuff big thumbs up. I think, you know, you can look this. I believe this is the Madrid. Yeah, this is the Madrid black, black outsole. Um, mine's a woman's 8.5, which is my normal size I wear. They don't necessarily feel like you're walking on a cloud when you buy like a new shoe and you're like, oh, it feels like a pillow, but they conform to your feet and they feel good. Maybe that's the way to say it. Um, I don't have any arch problems or any situations like that with my feet. I'm not sure about somebody with an arch problem. I think if you did size up, you could put a, you know, insole in here. Um, they really, they look nice and clean. They stayed clean. They got a lot of usage. You can see the bottoms got a little dirty there from just being used. But guys, I think it's amazing. And I think if you're looking for that hands-free shoe, something breathable, the material feels so nice, you got to jump on the Kizik. You can get them at their website. I'll have the link below. Watch for coupons. That's how I got mine. I got it with a coupon. But I really do feel like this was the great work slash conference shoe for me. It worked every day with every outfit on every occasion. And I, I wasn't like feeling like I was wearing tennis shoes when I had my suit pants on and it kind of came over the top and then it just, you know, it just looked like a black shoe. But in all fairness, I think we're all being easy on each other about our shoes because we got to get back to wearing normal shoes. So kizik.com, foot activated shoe technology, hands-free shoes. It gets the Terry Buy stuff big thumbs up. And you get the big thumbs up for being here today and watching the video. I appreciate you wanting to learn more about these shoes. I do think you will love them. So as always, I appreciate you. I love you. If you're not a subscriber, hit that button below, ring the bell, and that way you'll be notified of more shopping fun that happens here on this channel. So with that, I will let you head over to kizik.com and check out shoes for you. We'll see you on the next round, guys. Bye.